Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Java Reflection is a powerful feature that allows you to inspect and manipulate classes, methods, and fields at runtime. This can be particularly useful for various tasks such as testing, serialization, or frameworks that need to work with objects generically. In this tutorial, we'll focus on how to invoke a method without parameters using Java Reflection. Hashtag 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 Overview of Reflection Reflection allows you to Inspect classes, methods, and fields. Create new instances of classes. Invoke methods, even if they are private. Access and modify fields, even if they are private. Hashtag 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 invoking methods without parameters. To invoke a method without parameters using reflection, you will typically follow these steps. 1. Get the class object of the class whose method you want to invoke. 2. Retrieve the method object representing the method you want to invoke. 3. Create an instance of the class, if the method is not static. 4. Invoke the method using the method object. Hashtag 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 example code. Let's consider a simple class named myClass that contains a method called sayHello, which prints a greeting message. We will use reflection to invoke this method. Hashtag 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 step 1, define the class with the method. Hashtag 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 step 2, use reflection to invoke the method. Now, we'll write a separate class to use reflection to invoke the say hello, method. Hashtag 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 explanation of the code. 1. Getting the class object. Class dot for name, my class, retrieves the class object associated with my class. The class name should be fully qualified if it is in a package, example com example dot my class. 2. Creating an instance. My class dot get declared constructor, dot new instance, creates a new instance of my class. This calls the default constructor. 3. Retrieving the method. My class dot get method, say hello, retrieves the method object representing the say hello method. Since this method has no parameters, we do not need to specify any parameter types. For invoking the method, method.invoke, my class instance, invokes the say hello method on the instance my class instance. If the method were static, you would pass null as the first argument. Hashtag 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 error handling. The code includes a broad catch block for exception. In a production scenario, you might want to catch specific exceptions, example class not found exception, no such method exception, instantiation exception, illegal access exception, and invocation target exception, to handle errors more gracefully. Hashtag 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 conclusion. Java reflection is a powerful tool, but it should be used judiciously due to potential performance overhead and security implications. This tutorial demonstrated how to invoke a method without parameters using reflection, which can be useful in various scenarios such as dynamic method invocation, testing frameworks, or generic programming.